It's a beautiful day at Mills Motors, 240 Bond Street East in Oshawa. This is the 2017 Buick Enclave front wheel drive in the Quicksilver Metallic 3.6 liter dock direct inject V6 engine and six speed automatic transmission. All leather upholstery in this one, driver adjustable seat with a lumbar support, eight way driver seat, and we do have heated steering wheel, heated seats. We're gonna get to all that in just a minute, but we're gonna start over here on the left-hand side and work our way in. Power windows, power locks, and heated power mirrors. You also have memory seat and memory mirror. And a driver blind spot information system right here where my finger is located. You see that icon there? That's gonna illuminate when somebody's in your blind spot, so it's gonna save you a lane change that you're gonna to come to regret. Got some interior lighting here. And a beautiful leather wrapped steering wheel. Love the inserted uh, wood, wood insert into that leather wrapped steering wheel. And yeah, it is a heated steering wheel, like we said. And there is your icon for that. Cruise control options over here on the left hand side. Got your headlights and intermittent wipers and turn signals located right here. Right hand side has your hands free calling, an audio source selector, and a volume switch right here on the steering wheel itself. Another classic throwback, it's the analog clock built into the dash, and it's got some storage space located above that. MP3 compatible CD player, auxiliary input, you got AM, FM, Sirius XM satellite radio, time and temperature display, and you can get yourself set up for your hands free calling right here and enjoy the media on your paired device. Back to the home screen by using this button right here. And you'll see that you also have Stitcher Smart Radio app installed, SMS text messaging, and you can enjoy Bluetooth streaming audio. You also have USB as well. All right, it's back to the home screen once again. And continue on. You got your hazards right here. Tri-zone climate control for heating and air conditioning. You can control the temperatures in the back, or you can let the passengers uh, take control of that themselves. But uh, should you decide to control the temperature in the rear, you're just going to press that button right here. It's automatic temperature control as well. Or if you really wanted to, you could sync it up to what the driver has uh, decided is going to be the uh, the right temperature for the vehicle. And uh, just by hitting that, all three zones will be the same temperature that the driver selects. Fan speed operator here, front and rear defrosters. And below that, you got your air conditioning button right there. Heated seats on both driver and passenger side. That's your rear wipers, traction control, and a tra uh, this is for your interior lift gate release. That's what I'm trying to say. 12 volt power here and USB port. Nice leather wrapped gear shifter. Pair of cup holders and that beautiful wood grain trim once again. Before we get any further, I'm going to show you our full color rear backup camera with trajectory and ultrasonic parking sensors. Open this up and there's lots of storage in here. You can actually remove this tray, which has coin holders in it, not corn holders, uh, coin holders, and some deep storage space, more 12 volt power under there. And we also have a sliding armrest, which pops up and more storage space inside and this will actually move forward and back so it can be uh, comfortable to whatever position you decide and you have your all leather upholstery here once again beautiful stitching power windows and locks over here on the passenger side and you have a locking glove box top portion is uh, this uh, locks up here as well there you go and you got your OnStar services right there at the rear view mirror located above that you're going to find your garage door opener settings and some interior lighting. 19 inch aluminum wheels coming to you with wheel locks and Michelin tires. Let's check out the rear of this Buick Enclave. Dual chromed exhaust and there is a look at your ultrasonic parking sensors down there. Now to get in you can use the interior release, you can put your hand right under here and just press that and it's going to open up or you can use the key bob as I'm going to do now and you'll see you also have a remote start on this there you go it's going to hold down that button for a couple of seconds and that uh, lift gate's going to open up nice and wide a very large berth uh, to get things into it and there is a look at the storage space you have with the third row seating up more storage located here below 
cargo hook tie downs located on both sides and 12 volt power for you on the left. All right, so to put these third row seats down to give you even more options, very easily done. One hand on the camera here. Again, pull up the latch, push forward, and there you go. Third row seating is now down, nice and flat. And of course, yes, those captain's chairs in the second row, they will lie down nice and flat too. We'll show you in just a moment how to do so. But in the meantime, this is how simple it is to get those third row seats back up. Just gonna reach in, grab those tethers, and pull back. Just like so. Again, one hand on the camera. And to close it up, I'm gonna reach up, press this button right here, and it's gonna close back into place. Or you could have simply used the key fob once again. Let's get into the second and third row seating now and show you how to work those seats. First of all, let's show you, we've got the integrated turn signals here on the mirrors and chromed door handles. On the inside, wood grain trim once again, power windows and nice dark tinted glass. And tri-zone climate control, there's your controls for the passengers in the second row there. 12 volt and USB power as well, and those floor mats. All right, all leather upholstery once again. So let's check out how to, uh, work these seats. So first and foremost, let's fold it flat for some storage. I'm just going to use one finger, watch this, and pull that tether and there you go. Both of those captain's chairs will fold down nice and flat just like so. And one hand to put it back in position. And there you go, you're ready for your passengers again. Now let's say you want to get into the third row of seating. Well if you've got little kids sitting in the third row seat, you know what they're going to do. They're just going to walk up around here and into the back, no problem. But adults are, well, we're a little bit less uh, adventurous than that. Maybe we're not as much fun. That's a good way of saying it. How to get into the third row seating, very easy. One hand on the camera here, remember, I'm just gonna grab this handle, pull forward, okay? So that's the first step. Now, because I've got one hand on the camera, I'm gonna switch hands here. And as I push, this is going to flip up. So check this out. There you go, it's flipped up and I'm pushing forward. And there you go, a wide berth into the third row of seating, just like so. And to put it back in position, again, one hand, I'm gonna push back and push down, and we are all squared away. And that's a look at the 2017 Buick Enclave in the Quicksilver Metallic. This one with the safety and connectivity of OnStar and its own 4G LTE wireless hotspot. If you want to test drive this one, come on down to Mills Motors, 240 Bond Street East in Oshawa, where we'll always do whatever it takes.